Welcome to episode three of our West Coast Adventure with Continental Tires, doing their big new release for their new Extreme Contact Sport 02. This event was so much fun. It actually took place in Palm Springs, but they planned this really fun scavenger hunt where they brought out six of us YouTubers, threw us in M4 competition BMWs, courtesy of BMW Performance Driving School, and we got to rip around LA and do this really, really fun scavenger hunt. If you missed episode one and two, you know, there's a playlist. You can uh, watch those as well. This is day three and we hit the road from Los Angeles to Palm Springs. And y'all, I got the GoPro going, so there's plenty of in-car shenanigans. And I wish that I would have had the guts to put it on the outside of the car, but I didn't. Continental gifted us this GoPro, so I didn't really feel like I wanted to risk losing it. <laughs> so, lots of in-car goofiness. Heidi and I have such a blast. Heidi is a professional photographer that I brought along with me on this trip. America's Meanest Cars is her company and she does such an incredible job. Her photography is included in the episode and I can't wait for y'all to see it. And also drop me a comment, tell me what you thought. Let's get going. Yay. <laughs> I think I got it working. It's, um, I don't know, man. What time is it? It's 6.35 in the morning. Um, <laughs> I'm mostly awake. <laughs> <laughs> I decided to get out here early so that I could get this GoPro working. Yesterday morning, we did not get it working and we just hit the road and filmed with our phones, but it was so generous of Continental to provide this GoPro, so I really wanted to get it working so that we could utilize it. So now for our travels this morning and this afternoon to Palm Springs, we'll have GoPro. Yes. Okay, time to wait, where's the button? this. Yes. <laughs> oh, the sweetest Heidi of all time. All right. Heidi's loading her junk in the back of the truck. I'm texting with Fryburger right now because um, Julie, our lady with Continental, who is the bomb.com, she added a whole bunch of missions last night worth like 15 to 25 points. You may enter. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning. I'd like for you to meet Conti GoPro. Oh my goodness, hello. Conti Broker? <laughs> Conti GoPro? Did oh. I say go, go, bro, Pro Go? I don't know, but Conti Broco? <laughs> Conti Broco? Conti GoPro? Hi, dude. Conti GoPro. Oh, good morning. Ah. Yeah. Uh. So, um, I was just telling them how many missions they added last night. So many missions. <laughs> like, big pointer ones. Big points. Like, yesterday we were running around for like four pointers, and now they've added like 25. 15, 20, something. Yes, 12, 12 25 points. Three people yesterday got tattoos. <laughs> Literally, that's like some, tattoos. That's like, that's like some commitment, bro. Like,. <laughs> I don't even. How do we win after that? I don't know. But we're going to keep on accruing points so that hopefully, you know, it's undeniable. You know? We're still better. We have a better team. We're still better. I mean, <laughs> that's it. End game. Done. You're so dang cute. You are adorable. Okay, I'm texting Fryburger to see how um, inclined he is to help us with all these new missions. Oh my goodness. He's already said one. Yesterday I drove all day and she drove us to dinner and she got a little rip in. And I was like, dude, you've got to really actually drive this thing, drive yeah. this thing. So we're gonna switch places. This car is fun to drive. It's 500 horsepower, it's an inline six um, twin turbo. Yep. Twin turbo inline six is how I should phrase that. Um, but it's all wheel drive. And this is the first all wheel drive that car with had? power. I mean, I've driven like Subarus, okay, but, but no. not like, not fast different. Subarus. Um, this is a blast. Like I was telling her just to hammer down, just to put the throttle all the way to the ground and not have to like drive out of some craziness. Cause anytime I do that with like say Roxy and Roxy's only 600 at the tire, 
I mean, you're driving out. You're like, wah, 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 wah. You know, you're, you're hanging on for dear life. This one, it's just like, it just freaking grips and goes and goes straight. And it's just, just it's heavenly. It feels like cheating, um, quite frankly. Quite frankly. Words. Words. Good. I'm this chipper and I haven't had any coffee today, so who knows what could happen. It's gonna be good. Anyway, these tires grip like a beast. This car is super fun to drive, very torquey. Third gear specifically. I can't wait for you to uh, That's gonna be a good one. experience that. Okay, let's switch a roof. Okay. Turn her heated seat off because she's hot and I'm cold. Oh. No, you know what? What? I'm always good for a heated seat. Really? Yeah. Even when you're not cold? Yes. You like the toasty buns? I like the toasty buns. <laughs> Are we still recording? <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Okay, now I gotta get to Heidi Specs. Oh, that was not. <laughs> Oops. Now we're headed to Porto's. Yes, so we're gonna start the day off at Porto's. <clears throat> and it is, you know, very famous bakery. And it's one of the stops, but I think it's like two or four points or something. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Head south. You got it, sister. One of the weirdest things about this transmission, really there's only one weird thing about this transmission, is um, you put it into gear and it just sits. Like it doesn't engage like a normal automatic transmission. Turn left transmission. toward Empire Avenue, then turn left. You have to you have to input the throttle for it to go. Turn left toward Empire it's Avenue. Very different. Then turn left onto Empire Avenue. Whoa. In a quarter mile, turn left onto North Buena Vista Look Street. Turn left. You're like trying to get over the thing that's a left turn. Maybe not. We didn't exceed the speed limit, FYI. We, we just got to the speed limit rather rapidly. Yeah. We wouldn't do anything like that. Mm -hmm. No. my mirrors. Mirrors. So I am short and you are not. It's true. How tall are you? 5'2". Five 5'2". Two. Five two. I'm 5'10". I was like 5'9 when I was 14. <laughs> oh my goodness. And then I think I must have grown an inch because I was 5'9 forever. And well then... you want to know like the cutest thing? Yeah. So in sixth grade is when I hit 5'2 yeah. and I was the tallest in my class. <laughs> and then I stopped and then I never grew taller than my mom, which I was always so mad at. And that's where I've just been stuck forever. I think we both reached our heights early in life. Yeah. Yours just was a little bit taller. <laughs> it's just now seven. We I mean, are. We're early than we're we at expected. it, dude. Most of our opponents aren't even awake yet. Nope. They They're sleep. sleeping. Said that. And we've made it to Porto's. For some delicious coffee and pastries. <laughs> I'm so ready. Me too, dude. Are you freaking out, dude? I am. <laughs> it's beautiful. Oh, we are so fixed up. <laughs> it's a beautiful morning in California. seats are sick. Day's progressing. We're actually getting on the road to Palm Springs. We're uh, fueling the car up and 
We feel like we're doing pretty good, but um, Sam and James, who are um, South OC Cars and Coffee, um, they are winning. They're, they've got like 30 something missions completed and we have 27 or something. So they're ahead of us and they're local. So they know what stuff is. Like they're, they've got an advantage and they're using it. They're badass. And they're the two of the guys that got tattoos. So <laughs> we should just go lay by the beach and be lazy, but we can't stop. This is too fun. So it's awesome. Okay, we just got to this awesome hotel in Palm Springs, and um, we think this is one of the stops. It's uh, Taste the Rainbow, and it's like all these colors. Shout out to Justin on Instagram for that suggestion. Pretty sure he's right on this one. This looks awesome. It's two o'clock, and we haven't had lunch yet, so we decided to eat our ginger snap cookies from earlier. From, and they're amazing. From Porto's and they're so Porto's. yummy and special. It's wonderful. <laughs> Okay, we made it. I missed the turn for the first uh, for the first moment there. Missed the turn. This is super snazzy. We have made it. Now we have to figure out where everybody is. I think right there. Oh, Your there destination is on the left. We get greeted. Oh hey, how's it going, man? I'm going in for the continental event. Thank you. You let us in. <laughs> Okay. Jeez Louise. I think I saw everybody parked over there. Yeah, I did too. Well, we made it. We freaking we made it, dude. We made it. All the way. We got a good amount of points, right? Yeah, we you know really what I good. think we did. And I think we got a good amount of points. We made it here on time. Yeah, well, you know, they, yeah. they moved it up on us. Yeah. All the guys got here and were like, where's Emily and Heidi? Well, we're gonna be there at yeah. three o'clock, y'all. But we made it before three o'clock. We made it at two forty-five because we're awesome. And now on to the next part. Let's do it. That was a whirlwind. All the guys were waiting for us to load up in that transport van right back there. We're gonna run in and go to the restroom and then go to the hotel. But oh, all the cars are together again. We have to give our keys up. I think we're done with those cars. Wheels on the bus are going round and round. We have a whole crew. We're kind of quiet right now. Yuri's back here doing hand signals. We, <laughs> we just saw the Porsche flip up headlights and he was trying to get them to flip them up, but they didn't get it. They didn't know. Yeah. <laughs> We've got straight pipes, guys. Speed Academy, Fitman Industries. These are our bit winner winner chicken dinners here. Yeah, we had a competitive advantage. <laughs> <laughs> really did. And then they went and got tattoos, so then like yeah. just sent them overboard. 
We Stop. wanted those free times. Yeah. We're gonna get them, I bet. It's gonna be awesome. Imagine if we did all that till later. <laughs> that would be a story. <laughs> Almost to the hotel and then on to the evening adventures. Super sweet. Hooking us up with some shades. How neat was that? There is a market. That's awesome. Okay, this is a fun experience. We don't stay in many fancy hotels. The Ritz Carlton, the times that I've been inside one have been minimal. Actually staying in one, this is special. Um, wow, Continental has their own fancy custom keys for this event. That alone was cool enough, but like walking into this room, it's so beautiful. Bathrooms, kind of average, but walking through here, the view, freaking awesome. So beautiful. I'm so happy about this. Gorgeous. Holy cow. This is special. Thank you, Continental. I love y'all. It's time for me to freshen up and then head down for dinner. On up there, we're going to be watching. Of course, we got the squares over here. Whoever picked it, Brian would have a jersey with his own name on it. You won something. My guy. Yeah, have right, our yummy beverages. Food our food. Yum. Is this we're happy? No, it's, 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 it's not a trick question. A couple of people wanted. Did y'all get like a group discount because you got the same? Tattoo at the same time. There was no discount. No. It was like 400 bucks. Hollywood pricing. That was $400? Oh, Damn. California. Y'all were over. well on your way to a set of new Continental Extreme Podcast Sport O2s. Come in, Ray. Give it up. Who's got tattoos? Barely edging out the straight pipes. Peter and Kurt with 182 points. They're really close back there. Coming home, P3, Dakota and Alex with 211 points. <laughs> Hold on, Ryan. Hold on. Kids, I tell you what, there is are you getting a production credit here? What is you know, it? I used to have a Commodore 64 when I was growing up. Me too. Runner up. Who's it gonna and be? Probably our favorite in the whole oh, thing here. Thanks. Emily and Heidi with 282 points. <laughs> and then P1 with 351 points. Wow. James and Sam. That's right. Great job, guys. What an amazing day that was. And to end at such a gorgeous place like the Ritz Carlton in Palm Springs, the dinner and festivities were so fun. Ryan and Rutledge are great dudes and I'm so thankful that they are here at this event with us. Tomorrow is such a fun episode. I can't wait for you guys to see it. There is so much learning, so much driving. It's an absolute blast and even editing Tomorrow's episode, I had a permigrant totally cheesing the whole time I was editing it because I was having all those memories of how much fun we had. And tomorrow is a longer episode because there's so much driving. It's awesome. Can't wait for y'all to see it. Please drop a comment, a like, and a subscription if you haven't already. I'll see you tomorrow.